Hey guys, it's Professor Pro, and if you weren't aware, there's been this leak circulating recently, for about a day in fact, about Animal Crossing Switch. Let's go over it really quick. The leaker, who goes by John W. Cabrera on Twitter, gives us a lot of information on what will supposedly be new and returning in Animal Crossing Switch, such as balls from population growing, the flea market coming back, and new town environments such as desert and island. Now here's the thing. This person has zero credibility at all. You can check their Twitter. You can check anywhere that they've had a presence. They have not gotten a single thing right. Why is everyone treating this like it's gospel? Like, this has gotten way more popular than it deserves any right. It's as if people don't realize that literally anybody can set 20 minutes aside to write a fake leak and post it on 4chan or Twitter or Reddit or anything. It's not that complex. And here's the thing, here's the kicker, guys. This leaker, quote unquote, has been wrong before. They claimed back in January of 2018 that we'd be seeing home themes on the Switch. Here we are, a year later, and we've gotten no such thing. There is no reason anybody should be taking anything this guy says as reason for stuff we could see in Animal Crossing Switch. Most of the things the guy said, yes, I would like to see in the game. Bat villagers, I literally said that in one of my prediction videos. Rotatable camera, that adds so much death, no pun intended, to the game, but... There's no reason to believe anything this guy's saying, and I'm surprised that this has gotten as much traction as it has. It literally almost has 1,000 likes at this time of recording. Look, I'm not saying that there's no chance that this could ever happen. We've seen much, much weirder leaks before. But right now, we have no reason to believe, no reason to think that this guy could ever have this kind of insider information. And so much of the stuff is either A, highly requested by fans, or B, so like random that you would wonder how someone could even get that information. Like along with stuff like rotatable camera, you have, oh, you can now move furniture while you have villagers over. What? That's so random. That's not something you put in a leak. I feel like nowadays people have really let their standards down for what counts as a leak. Like come on guys, this is stuff that Lax Chris would cover. And so, I'm sure I'll get comments about it if I don't say this, I am 100% team fake on this leak. There is no reason to think it could ever be real, so just stop, stop. I'm not judging you if you believe it, but I personally don't. Anyways, why don't you guys comment down below things that you liked about this fake leak, things that you'd still want to see. I read all the comments. I'll see you guys in the next video. Professor Pro signing out. Thank mm -hmm. you.